talking about Wolfgang Puck, the one and only, the culinary legend, the Harvard man. He's been here for over 20 years. He's a James Beard Award winner. You know the name, even if you've never shopped here at HSN. By the way, if you are new, welcome. I'm Shannon. You're going to meet the amazing Wolfgang Puck in his basically testing kitchen where he does all those Oscar preps. You're going to see the wall of fame behind him. But this deserves its own golden statue. Can I tell you why? Wolfgang Puck has no peer in the world of appliances here at HSN. Every air fryer, basically every appliance, but every air fryer he has ever done has not only sold out, has sold out early. So last year I bought it, maybe you bought it, he did a seven quart for about the same price. This is the nine quart, it's basically, a, I almost said a mini convection oven, but there's nothing mini about this because you're getting nine quart capacity, you're getting simple dial control, Basically, you heat, you set it, you forget it, and you get the best results of all time. You're also getting that great little um, air frying basket, plus the, the all of the recipes. And ask about Marion's book. Okay, I wanna double check. Guys, do we have my, are my, are my, okay. Final thousand on that cookbook. Is it okay if I go here? I'm gonna jump around. Okay, all right. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Holy moly! And I gotta be honest, I think we had room for more. So no one does it like Wolfgang. In fact, you know what, I'm gonna see, does Victoria, do we have any hot sauce that I can drizzle drazzle over that with a little blue cheese? Okay, do we have some? Well, you know what, Wolfgang, I'm channeling you. I'm getting a little fancy here in my kitchen, but I don't uh, care if you're doing... I have, I have that <laughs> do you have... <laughs> Wolfgang, all right. It's, it, it's uh, you're on. One minute, okay? Because okay. <gasps> we don't have four different tables to roll them around like you have over there in this. Just put it on top, it's okay. Uh, see, I like that I've got something that Wolfgang doesn't have. So let me just show you what we have left it, while Wolfgang does that. Remember, we have loaded every single one that we possibly can. Here's your white, here's your black. Okay, in that black, this could be the final airing. So there are only a thousand to go around. By the way, that was 10 pounds of wings in 45 minutes, 10 pounds of wings in 45 minutes. And then of course we have the red. Also, get on Autoship or try his seasonings. When I said that he's revealing all the secrets to you, Boy, not only is this set it and forget it, if you want to do cauliflower steaks, if you want to do air fried chicken, if you want to do anything from your own breaded chicken nuggets or vegetables, you have to try those seasonings. Those are also in sellout quantity, but nobody does an air fryer. Nobody does an appliance like Wolfgang. Not only is this set it and forget it, but think about it. This is a mini convection oven. Now you can do sweet or savory. So I did an, an Elvis Presley special, his, his favorite uh, peanut butter, banana, and bacon sandwich in this with no oil, no fat whatsoever. Are, uh, Wolfgang, are you there? The okay. last one, and it's so much easier. You can cook for two or you can cook for six in there. So it's so much better than having a little one. Who wants a little one where you can't even cook one portion of french fries perfectly? So this does everything for you. You on a diet, you get our seasoning. Look at it. Here I have our roasted salmon with our seasoning. And I take it right in my air fryer here. So cooking fish, chicken, meat, whatever you do, it always will come out Perfect, simple, easy. Squeeze a little lemon on top, just like I do here. And that's all you have to do. And you will have a meal. You're gonna say, wow, I didn't know I cook so well. You know, it's delicious. It's easy to execute. And then the main thing is look at the tenderness and look at the juiciness of the fish in here. See that? Look at that. Oh, Wolfgang, that is beautiful. You know, it's I not- know. It's It flakes away just like that. Look, here you can see it. $20 Perfectly on cooked your salmon. Card. I mean, if I will get one like that in one of my upscale restaurants and pay $45 for it, I still would be happy. You know, I would say, wow, they cooked the salmon to perfection. Now you can do it. You can. And you know what? Now I have to tell you a story because somebody asked about this cutting board here. 
You know where it came from? It came from Greg, Marian's husband. He made it for me, for me for my graduation. He made me a cutting board instead of a medal, but I love that bed. I use it every day. When I graduated about a year ago, you know, I went to these classes at Harvard at graduation. He made me this beautiful board. And I have another one at home. I thought it was the other one, but uh, this is beautiful. All right, so this is our cutting board. French fries here, a little longer. So all you have to do, put the timer on, put it at 400, and wait about 10, 15 minutes, and you have fried uh, fr French fries. Hey, Wolfgang, now let's look in here. I was gonna uh -huh. ask, can I also do I'm like gonna show you one more thing here. Slice them. Give me a plate of something that I can land my chicken. These are my beautiful chicken breasts here. And you can see it, totally lean. Look in here, no oil in my machine. You don't need anything. And then the outside totally crispy. And look how juicy that breast is here. Beautiful. It's about as good as anything can be. No, no, no breaking up mouth. You have the beautiful pieces of chicken just like that. I mean, you know, if I were you, I would get that right away and not wait until the price goes up because this will help you to be a better cook, especially in times like that, where we have to spend more time. Look how, how shiny my chicken is. Can we get a close-up of that here? Oh, Wolfgang, it looks Ooh, great. Yeah. Oh, and so tender, because we marinated it in buttermilk. Oh, good idea. Now, and that's your spices. And then breaded it. So those are Wolfgang spices. I know you've been seeing that item number on the or on the side of your screen. Couple of quick updates for you. If you want Marion's cookbook, uh, so <laughs> poor Hannah. Of course, Wolfgang's doing all the heavy lifting in his prep kitchen. You can see the Oscar Wall of Fame in the background. So um, we didn't have any hot sauce or or little bougie accoutrement as I like to have, but you can kind of fill in the blanks. This is just one of the recipes in the air fryer book from Marion. There are only a thousand to go around. Speaking of final quantities. If you are just channel surfing, you know the name Wolfgang Puck. He is inimitable, he's a Harvard man, he's got his own star on the Walk of Fame. He cooks for every single Oscar. That's when we go back to him in California, that's what you'll see, the Celebrity Hall of Fame. No name more respected, awarded, and certainly known in the industry. So even if you're new to HSN, you have to understand, first of all, join us and welcome. You want an air fryer, you want Wolfgang Puck's air fryer. Basically, there are no hot and cold spots. This is a one day only value. It is the lowest price. First of all, it's the largest capacity, but his seven quart sold out at the same price last year. Nine quart, nobody else in the world makes it. Beautiful profile. I already dumped the wings, but I'll just show you again. Nice deep basin. And this is also a nice nonstick. I almost brought in one of my comparative air fryers, but I didn't want to shame them because this is a lot easier to clean. Plus, of course, bigger capacity. We did on our end here in Florida, 11 pounds, or I'm sorry, 10 pounds of chicken wings in 45 minutes. Black, we have fewer than 1,000 remaining. It's also available in white or red. And I think, does Adam only have one more earring coming up to, okay. Well, it's, it's the final look is coming up in uh, Adam's open house show tonight. Wolfgang, I'm gonna def defer to you, my expert. I, I heard that you've got, you know, a roasted chicken. You've got a lot going on in California. Everything, one of my new favorite is sweet potato tarts. Look at that here. We serve this year at the Oscar, all these tarts with a little cream. But you know how I serve the sweet potato one? I put honey. Oh, I have to open it up, it's better. <laughs> all right. <laughs> See, it is live TV. I have my glasses and it's not good enough. <laughs> so you put a little bit of that. And if you like it home, you like it spicy, for a drink, put a little chili on top, or if we have some uh, 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 jalapenos or something, you can put that. Or another good trick is just 
put a little bit of sour cream and scallions on top. Look how beautiful it looks and it tastes even better. So you make out of something, out of the freezer case, something people are gonna say, wow, how did you do that? And you know what? Just don't tell them you bought it. Just tell them you were working all morning roasting your sweet potatoes and mixing them up with a little egg and flour. So Wolfgang, you is that beautiful, it, lover? It is. So I can get results like that even if I'm going to my frozen food section of, of my grocery store. So no kidding. From or go ahead, my friend. A hundred percent. I want you to be a hundred percent sure when you cook at home that it comes out perfect. So if you go to the grocery store or you make it yourself, it doesn't really matter. My son, Oliver, you know, he gets hungry at night and he plays music. He's a music producer. He says he does all the beats for rap singers. So he doesn't sleep at night. He's a nocturnal guy. He gets up and makes French fries for himself all the time. I hear him. Or if I don't hear him, I see traces of French fries. I said, who was in the kitchen? We cleaned it last night and now have French fries on the floor. It's terrible. And then I told Oliver, did you cook French fries? He says, yeah, Dad, I do that often. When I get hungry, I have French fries. And then all he does is just like that. Look at that. You hear it? Now, obviously, you made many more than I did. So we have beautiful french fries here. And then we put a little salt and pepper on here. Where is my salt meal? Okay, maybe a little bit of salt. Here we have the barbecue salt, the smoky salt, and then put a little ketchup on top. Mmm, I love how it smells with the barbecue, with the smoked salt, it smells like barbecue. It's so delicious. And look at that, the french fries, perfectly crispy. Oh, okay, Not yeah. an ounce of fat. You know how much oil you would need to do that many french fries? And that's not a lot, maybe for three, four people. How much it would take to fry that? You need a gallon of oil. You know how expensive a gallon of oil is? Much more the french fries than the french fries. And you know how many calories added up because of the oil? more than the potatoes. So all of a sudden, you wonder, why can't you lose weight? Because if you eat fried things, it's one thing. But if you eat air fried thing, then you know you can lose weight too. Well, and I, you have leave the it flavor to of it. And let me show one more thing. Where's my bag here? My bag of the fries? And like sooner or later, we get it down to a science. We're gonna get the bag up here. But meanwhile, we are waiting, but it's okay. i show you. Huh? Okay, here we are making some baked pasta in here while we are waiting. So this is like a takeout from Spargo because Spargo, the restaurant, is closed. So now what we have is a little takeout here. Oh. Let me get a spoon or something. Look at that. Oh, Wolfgang, that's Some awesome. Left, you could Woo! make leftover pasta just like that. This is some macaroni with tomato sauce, and then we put the cheese on top and baked it in the air fryer. Look, steaming hot right out of the oven. Beautiful. Hey, Wolfgang, I'm just going to give him a couple of updates, and uh, you really nailed it. First of all, the fact that you can make even French fries look gourmet from the freezer section is amazing. But he was talking about reheating. Remember, yes, it's technically called an air fryer, but this is a convection oven. So you can do sweet, you can do savory, you can do bacon, you can do whole breakfast in this. Uh, we'll show you, I actually did the famous Elvis Presley sandwich in, in it earlier, and you can and you will. Has that removable basket. Now, we say to be safe, a five pound chicken, but I think upwards of seven, so five to seven in that kind of wheelhouse. There are only two dials. 1700 watts so you're getting amazing power but not only that the big the biggest and the best capacity on the market 
beautifully cooked but moist because it cooks so fast it actually seals everything in and uh, actually Wolfgang was talking about the amount of oil that you'd save on your french fries you can do that peanut butter banana and bacon or you know fried air fried peanut butter and jelly sandwiches with no oil no fat in this I did this last night and I should tell you you can fit four full-size um, sandwich like grilled sandwiches which by the way there are a lot of regular pans that won't do that and just to show you capacity again and I know that Wolfgang has a roasted chicken out there in California just because you know I do things visually but this is just you know that standard like if you're doing your little graham cracker crust if you're doing a pie crust in this if you're baking your macaroni and cheese if you're doing your souffle that's how deep this basin is but remember no hot and cold spots. We have loaded everything we have. Price expires at midnight. This is one of your last shows. Adam's coming up with whatever's left coming up at nine o'clock. The white, the black, we are in the hundreds. The black, we are in the hundreds. And then of course we have the red as well. Ask about Wolfgang Spices. I know Wolfgang was showing this to you in California. Holy schmoly, man. Just to, so you can kind of see the capacity uh, live in our studios here as well. Oh, by the way, did we say non-stick? So I'll tell you what, even if the insert is not sticking to this, I mean, so you can go that big or, you know, you can cook for one or you can cook for, you know, 10. So the option is up to you, but you can never make more in a smaller fryer. Remember only two dials, it shuts itself off. Uh, Wolfgang, I'm anxious to see what else you got going on, on in there All in right, California. I'm just gonna show everybody out there what my son Oliver does. So I have these bags of frozen french fries because often I don't wanna cook and that was even before we had uh, uh, the, the pandemic. So I have that always handy. And that way, if kids come over, all we do is throw them in the, in the air fryer. And then even still frozen, no defrosting needed, no preheating needed. You put, put it on here and put it on 400 and put it for about 18 minutes or so, and you will get perfect fries. The kids will love it, they will eat it, you don't have to get, feel guilty to give the children fried food. It's, it's, now, let's go to our chicken down here. I'm oh, gonna get good. it out of here. I can smell it already. Ooh, look at this baby here. All right, come with me. Come home with me. Uh, we are at home already, okay. Uh, we shouldn't say that, huh? All right, let's push it down. Okay, now I'm gonna take this out and you will see the size of my chicken. Yeah. Wolfgang, what is that Look about a six that. pound? Is that about like a six pound chicken, give or take? Six and a half, almost seven pound. Okay. You know, this chicken is enough for at least four people, if not more. When we eat at home with the children, Galila and myself, this serves more than what we need because I don't eat that much at night anyway, but the kids love it. Why? Because it's crispy and it's really tasty. So Wolfgang, what did that take? About an hour or so in the air fryer? Yeah, this took about an hour and 10 minutes okay. because it's six and a half pounds, you know, almost seven pounds. And look, that will be, but the good thing is, while this is cooking, you don't have to do anything. This will cook. You can do whatever you like to do. And look, the even browning all around. Can you see that? Beautiful. Everywhere the same, and the skin is crispy. You can hear it. All right. Okay, oh, let's Wolfgang, cut that I off I can here. see the juice from here. Holy moly. Look how juicy, yeah. Oh, wow. Okay, let me take that up here. Look at that. Wow. <gasps> wow. Oh, that's incredible. Yeah, so it keeps on juicing and juicing and juicing. I mean, really amazing. All right, put it on here, up. Oh, Wolfgang, that's gorgeous. Yeah, 
So here's Perfect. The and the great thing is I had nothing to do with it, you know? So that's really what I like um, the most about this, the way we do this chicken. It's, it's, it's dynamite. Well, I can't recommend yeah. it enough. Hey, if you do want Miriam's cookbook, um, I should point out there is a basic roast chicken. That's probably the biggest question we get when we do these air fryers. No other air fryer in the world is gonna accommodate a chicken of that size. He's got the biggest, my own personal opinion, I think he has the best. You've heard me say that about his appliances before. If you want Miriam's cookbook, we have fewer than a thousand. Wolfgang is doing most of his uh, demonstrations in um, California on the black version. We have in the hundreds, remaining on that black version. Now remember, there's just two no knobs. It's a set it and forget it machine, which I think is genius. Temperature, of course, all the way up to 400 degrees. Then if you want something like that chicken, you just, you know, let her go again. And then I want you to hear that. Dinner's done, mom. Whenever you hear that, okay, dinner's done. I'm, I actually take pictures of my stove to make sure I've shut them off. That's how cuckoo I am. This means never having to worry about you left the stove on. And, and Wolfgang, if you do have kids in the kitchen, like you said, Oliver does his own stuff. Um, even for someone who might be wheelchair assisted and can't bend over to get in a, a, a lower or a regular oven, you could actually use this as your oven replacement and feel safe about it, right? Totally, it's so much easier. And you know what, look look at now I'm cooking here. See that they're from the breast, the chicken coming out, the juice of the chicken. This is a chicken breast. Now, I know you go to the stores, buy a roasted chicken. They roast it when they want, not when you want. Now, look at so much meat here. And save the carcass, the thing to make a chicken soup or chicken stock. All right, let me clean up a little bit here. And we continue. So, Wolfgang, I am now, I'm, sh I'm getting this for my mom and for my dad because uh, you know, my mom and my dad, they, they like fried food, but you know, we're all at the age where we're kind of watching that fat intake. So mom, this is early Mother's Day. Dad, this is early Father's Day. You should do it, whether it's Mother's Day, Father's Day, if you want to give mom a break in the kitchen with all that homeschooling and everything else going on, run around to the stores to try to find toilet paper. This is as easy as set it and forget it. And if Wolfgang Puck, of course, Harvard man, the, the man who really created the American landscape of how we look at cooking in America, he is giving to you the biggest capacity, not only at HSN, but largest capacity in an air fryer, period, don't just look at this as an air fryer. You'll use it to bake your pies. You'll use it for your little pizzas. You'll use it for breakfast quiche. You'll use it to do sweets and savories, grilled cheese with no oil, his world-class steak. But you're getting larger capacity than anyone else offers. We have loaded everything that we possibly have before that price goes away. So uh, we are doing it for $19.90. The seven quarts sold out for the same price last year. Final call, Adam has the final series of airings at nine, but the white, the black is in the hundreds remaining, and then the red. Please get these spices. In fact, Allison, are these available on auto ship? Okay, I'm, I'm actually gonna get an auto ship on these, and that's really kind of the keys to the kingdom. Wolfgang is really kind of taking your hand. He's doing all the heavy lifting and doing that pre-seasoning. So rosemary, roasted garlic, and then lemon pepper, and sweet and, th and sweet and spicy. You can ask about that as well. And then if you want Marion's book, we're in the hundreds remaining there. Wolfgang, what's going on in California? I'm curious. Hang on, I'm making one of the dishes we had at the Oscars. And I'm gonna show you, I have a bigger plate I would do at home, but I'm gonna show you in a second how we served it. Can I get the small porcelain bowl we served it in? Eric? Yes, sir, right away. All right, well, they had same as the soup we served. Okay, we have enough, yep. All right. Okay, put that here. Yes, chef. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, okay, good. Now look at that. No oil, no nothing in here. Can you look in here? Oh, Wolfgang, wow. Perfect. Wow, wow, wow. So simple, so easy. You don't have to worry. It won't soak up. You don't have to check if the temperature is right. You have two knots here. One is for the temperature and one is for the timer. Now, look at that here. So, at the Oscars, we put a few in here, just like that, and then we put a little cream, just like that. You know, potatoes and cream is always delicious. And then, instead of putting 
like salmon caviar, we used sturgeon caviar. And then put a little bit of chopped fresh herbs, if, but we don't have any. So we don't put any. So put that on top, and that's it. So that's how we serve the whole thing, thousands of them, just like that. Oh, wow. We made it from scratch, but you know what? I think this one is just as good. I know Eric would be upset at me and says what you're saying. I'm sure nobody will know the difference. When I serve them at home and I tell them, I made them to order. I just made them this morning. People are going to say, okay, I understand. Look I'm telling that. you, you're, you're doing Minnesota proud. You know, tater tots are a food group where I'm from. Yeah. <laughs> you like, you, I like them a lot. You know, it's a perfect snack. You sit around with a glass of wine. I mean, there's nothing better. You think potatoes are so mundane. Potatoes are no big deal. I love potatoes. I eat them all the time. Maybe because I grew up in Austria with a lot of potatoes, especially in the winter time. Okay, we have more fries here. Look what I have here too. Our chicken pot pie. Every year, Baba tries and asks, you know, Wolfgang, hopefully I'm coming to the Oscar, hopefully you made your chicken pot pie. And every year I make it for the last 15 years, I think so. So oh, wow. look at that. You can bake in it and look how evenly everything is, how evenly baked and totally well done. Oh, Wolf, Just that's have to beautiful. watch when you take it out. It's very hot in there. Wow. Okay. And now, let me get a smaller knife. Here it is. Look at that. Totally crispy the crust. See that? That's what you want for your chicken pot pie. And you can open oh. it up. Look in here. Mm. You're making us hungry, Wolfgang. Well, you know what? You can cook just the way I do. I don't do much, really. You know, all I do is use the leftover chicken, which we roasted, made a little velouté out of it, and put vegetables in it, and then filled up my cups here. Well, it, um, it tastes so delicious. Well, well done, my friend. And the thing is, you can get Wolfgang Puck results in your kitchen, but you've got to have the right appliance. So it's the right appliance, yeah. the right price, the right time. We're the only ones who have it. So if you are new to HSN, of course, welcome. You probably recognize Wolfgang. You probably recognize the name. He does not sell this at his world-class restaurants. He does this only and exclusively for us and only for today. The seven quart sold out last year for about the same price. But now you get, it still is a nice profile, by the way. So it's still going to fit easily on your countertop. Simple two-dial control, but non-stick insert with that basket. Easy to clean. You can throw it and you know top rack or you know dishwasher frankly you'll probably just rinse it out under uh, water in the sink there is a little itty bitty you know a couple recipes and instructions that come with it but i definitely ask about marion's book but we have loaded everything that we have for this show and then of course the last shot with adam twenty dollars on your credit card plus shipping and tax 90 day return policy 90 days to give this a try you should think Mother's Day, Father's Day, give mom and dad a break in the kitchen. Kids can cook for themselves. No exposed element or thing to worry about or hot oil with add calories and, you know, unsafe conditions in the kitchen. The white, the black, this is the one I'm sending to my parents for, you know, early mothers and early Father's Day because, you know, my parents do fry. And, you know, the house does smell like oil when they do it. And frankly, we're all kind of watching our fat intake. So mom, Call you later, but it's on the way. I know she's gonna tell me, oh, you shouldn't have, but no, trust me, I'm kind of buying it for me so I can use it when I go there. <laughs> so, and then of course we got the red. So Wolfgang, any parting thoughts? We've only got a couple of minutes remaining. Why do you love this one in case they're tuning well, in? I, say, I really believe uh, the way we are now with the pandemic, with everybody under house arrest, basically, you know, we have to eat. But if we just eat anything, what happens is we'll gain so much weight. The summer will come when they let us out a little bit. You're going to say, oh, my God, look at that. I don't fit in my clothes anymore. I don't fit in my summer clothes or in my bikini anymore. So I think this will eat, make you eat delicious food, but with less calorie in a healthier way. So I think that's really important. And with the air fryer, you save so much money in energy first. You don't have to preheat anything. Second, if you want to have French fries and you fry them in oil, 
a gallon of oil costs $12. So then what you're gonna do with it? Fry every day? And in my home, I know when my wife uh, saw me frying, she used to get upset. She said, I'm gonna build your kitchen outside so that way not the house stinks up all with this oil smell. And I know when I go to a fast food restaurant, it smells like bad oil. And even I use the best oil and fresh oil all the time, still it smells up the house. Now I can.